The goal of this showcase is to demonstrate the visibility that can be gained into your organization's operations through RTLS and Power BI. In this example, the problem the client faced was that the canned reports they were currently using did not provide the flexibility and visibility needed. They needed a robust and tailored reporting tool that enabled them to see their desired metrics, as well as custom metrics, and view those metrics across the entire organization, as well as by clinic and provider. They needed more visibility. The visibility that was gained included understanding trends in patient volume, questions such as how long and where are patients waiting, how long does it take for patients to go through the care process, which providers are adding the most value to their patients. The data can then be used to make actionable decisions. It's working smarter and more efficiently. First, let's look at the KPI report. This report provides executives with a high-level view into the metrics most important to them to answer the question, is the organization going in the right direction? This report outlines the five metrics of greatest importance to the executives in the organization. Along the left-hand side of the report are cards displaying each of the five metrics, patient count, cycle time, patient value at a time, the amount of time a patient is with a provider, and lastly, the amount of time a patient is with a staff member. The organization has established a target goal for two of the five metrics, which we have built in. Next to each of the cards are line charts indicating the trend above the respective metric. This allows a user to quickly recognize if a core metric is trending in the wrong direction and then have the appropriate follow-up. On the right-hand side of the report, comparisons of these metrics across each of the clinics. This allows leaders to view the performance of each clinic and identify which clinics may help prove best practice. Additionally, these bar charts allow the user to filter across the report based on the clinic or clinics you've selected. Next, let's jump to the clinic report. This report provides directors with a high level, although more granular view of the operations within the organization. This report details six key metrics, allowing directors to answer the question what do we need to work on? On the left-hand side of the report are those six metrics at a quick glance. For two of the metrics, we've utilized a donut chart to show the breakout of late versus on-time starts and how many patients are seeing their provider within 15 minutes of their start. These vis visualizations allow directors to quickly determine if their clinic is operating as it should be in any given time frame. The middle of this report includes information pertaining to a patient's cycle time. This includes the total duration as well as each phase of care, illustrated by the pie chart. There are a few other elements included in this section. Patient volume by visit type is presented in a clustered bar chart. This gives ins insight into how many patients have been seen or how many physicals have been performed. This also allows the user to filter across the report based on any given visit type. Additionally, if we look at the lower right-hand corner of the report, we'll see an area chart visualizing wait time by day of the week. This enables directors to communicate with supervisors and ensure that staffing is appropriate for the day of the week. Thank you for watching this showcase of operational intelligence and RTLS. If you have any questions about our set of reports or want more information about how to embed business intelligence into your organization, please contact us at IDBailey.